We are going to do a walk through at Karib. Karib is a very, very popular complex in Orange Beach, has a ton of amenities. It is really high end luxury. People absolutely love owning here, staying here, vacationing here, bringing their families here. Tons and tons of amenities. Uh, this property sits uh, right, um, right north of the state park but also directly on the bay and right there where the pass is. If you've never been to the Carib, you, I highly recommend you go, but we are getting ready to walk through this three bedroom unit listed by our good friend, Candace Fab. Hi everyone. And that is short for fabulous. She is absolutely fabulous. We love her um, and we can't wait to uh, walk you through this condo. So come take a look with us. <music> Hey guys, if this is your first time to the channel, be sure to hit the like button, subscribe button, and ring the little bell so you can be one of the first ones to learn everything there is to know about the current market conditions in Orange Beach, Gulf Shores, and the surrounding areas. My name is Aileen Fountain, along with my partner Andy Hollis and our entire team. We do videos just like this each and every week just to be informative, just to let you know what it's like to actually live here, vacation here, and invest here. So whether it's nine days or 90 days from when you're thinking about making your purchase, give us a call, shoot us a text, email us, set up a Zoom. We'd love to meet with you face to face. We get calls, texts, and emails from people just like you every single day and we absolutely love it. So as I mentioned, we are gonna walk through this three bedroom, three bath condo at Karib. Um, This is Candace's listing. So she's mic'd up and she's gonna do a little talking too. So let's get to it. Welcome to D914. All right, Candace, it looks like we've got a really nice bedroom here to the right. Yeah, and I really love the way that they've set this up because that is a trundle bed under the double bed. So you can actually sleep five people in this room and still have a lot of space to move around versus trying to put a couple of different beds in here. So it's an ideal setup for a rental property. And you'll notice as we go through the unit that they have crown molding uh, in all the rooms. Okay. So sometimes you'll see in the living area, but that's not standard to create. So that is an upgrade that's been added. Okay. Yeah, and you're right. That room is still very spacious. Yep. And then we have the ceramic plank flooring in here versus the LVP that you see in a lot of the condos down here. Uh, and this room is large enough to accommodate a king bed. Oh, wow. Um, so there's a lot of potential uh, to do, you know, a little bit bigger bed in here. But this one does have the ensuite bathroom, whereas the other one has an adjoining bathroom that can be used for anybody staying in the living room on the sleeper sofa or in this bunk bedroom. Okay. 
And one of the nice features about Kareed too is they do have a lot of owner's closets. So this could actually be an owner's closet if you're renting it out and want to keep some personal belongings here. Yeah. And there's Definitely. another one in the master bath as well. Okay. And then um, they do have a new HVAC unit in this unit, which is really important. Awesome. Of course, we've got our laundry. Nice stackable washer and dryer there. Hot water heater. And Beautiful then this kitchen. is all customized cabinets that were redone a few years ago. Um, and it does have the soft close drawer feature on them as well. I noticed that. All the lighting has been updated. All the furnishings are very high end. All this was put together by a local interior designer. Okay. Got a wet bar here. Yep. So, and that ice maker is only a year or two old as well. All right, let's go into the primary bedroom here. Yeah, see, so we really have nicely oversized bedrooms in Korea. Oh, this is massive. So you can actually do sleeper chairs in here as well to expand your sleeping potential for the unit. Uh, it could probably accommodate two or three different sleeper chairs in here if you want to have that ability for somebody to have their kids in their room. Great view from this primary too. Yeah, and you have Hollywood furniture too on the balcony, which is an exceptional feature. Yes, I agree. Got a jetted tub, standalone shower, mm -hmm, tile, handheld, double vanity here. Really big bathroom, nice size. Private toilet there. Large walk-in closet here. And this is a non-rental, this is a second home for this family. Yeah, so they have it all customized to suit their family, but of course, changes are easy um, as needed. So um, just really perfect furniture for in here. These are yes. swivel chairs. Uh, like I mentioned previously, that is a sleeper sofa. Wow, that's uh, so a you, really nice sofa. You can actually sleep up to 11 people as it's currently outfitted, um, but it is possible to do more if you do some sleeper chairs as well. And Kareeb really does draw the, the groups that like to travel. So typically you'll have two or three families sharing a unit sure. as a rental. Yeah, and this unit is uh, 1,796 square feet and it faces the south, faces the gulf. And we're gonna come check this out because honestly, I have been in a lot of units in Kareeb and this is probably the best south facing view of any of them I've ever been in. Love to hear that. You have got uh, views of the pass, you have panoramic views of the gulf, and then you are right over the amenities. So you actually have amazing views of both um, pools and Lazy River, of course. Um, so we do has, have our new Tiki bar down there, as yep. well as our cabana rental. That Those was just, just built. This Tiki bar was just built and these cabanas were just added. They have been wildly popular. And Kareeb actually has more pools around the corner. But um, yeah, these are, the Lazy River is a very popular spot to be. Yeah, you've got the pet pet and the splash pad over there that's in front of this yep. C building. Yeah, right there. Um, and then there's a bayfront pool right to the right of this building. Yep. And that's got uh, slides and stuff too for the kids. It does. It is right in there. Can't see it from here, but that's where it is. And then of course that's Cobalt's over there with the- Cobalt, um, yep. That's where I'm having lunch in just a little bit. Perfect. <laughs> it's a good yep. choice. No, excellent views here. Um, nothing will ever be built. That is the state park in front of us. So nothing will ever be built there. And Karib, um, you can access the beach going right underneath the bridge. Uh, they do have a service, a golf cart service that will um, take you there. 
to the beach and you go under the bridge and you will be at the pass or you can take that boardwalk there and go directly onto the beach and then we have the, um yeah, you've also got a boardwalk the there as well what's that paid parking across yes, the street paid as well. parking right there um and another boardwalk so multiple access points but the pass is a pretty popular place to go hang out for um be at the beach for the day yep and they just redid that boardwalk so that just got completed so and this grill that. being allowed yep. um so that's here. electric that's an electric grill mm -hmm. okay good to know All right, that's going to do it for our walkthrough of this beautiful Kareeb listing uh, by Candace Fab, who is fabulous. Um, she has it listed at $925,000. A beautiful views, as, as you can see, plenty of space here, almost 1,800 square feet. Uh, Candace is um, known as an expert in Kareeb. Uh, she is uh, well versed in anything and everything that has to do with this complex. There's three buildings here, uh, D, C, and B. Lots of amenities. Uh, you definitely want to uh, check this out if you're interested in buying or uh, getting an investment property here in Orange Beach, Alabama. Hope you enjoyed this video, and until next time, we hope to see you around town.